Roy is not what I expected. Roy is not what Wild card pick. anyone expected. Yeah. Come on, come on, buddy. Green? Okay, we're going green. Did not expect that. In the yeah. Stars. Is the Roy the choice? I guess we'll find out. Is Roy Can he be in Blue's face? Because that's kind of the requirement to play Roy right now. Can you get in Sephiroth's face? I don't know Blue seems to be handling Roy in space pretty well. So far. I mean... Early days, 15 seconds. Yeah. Nez, okay. Nez. Oh. Big back air from Blue. Oh! Nice down air. Get Aerithed. <laughs> Get Aerith Law. Spoilers to anyone that hasn't played FF7 yet. It's a... Uh, 25 years old? Yeah, sound of the summer. Can't miss it. Can you turn up, Matt? No, no. I've already clipped the mic. I've seen it, though. You turn Matt up a little? No. No. You can move the mic close to your mouth. That's what you can do to help. Yeah, if you know help. Don't ASMR me, please. Say something. Uh, uh, say, say something in a normal speaking voice, please. Audio jungle. Is that it actually could be a little louder, I think. Why? Uh, huh, a little bit. Yeah, this is the first. It might be because you're talking quietly. Yeah, I feel like on purpose trying to talk quietly. Why? Yeah, just like a little bit. Also because I like, moved it slightly and like, ah, oh, I don't want ASMR. Oh, anyway, back to the game. Back to the game. Pretty even. Well, no. I just... won't turn you back down. <laughs> if you just speak at normal speaking volume, yeah, you'll be fine. Yeah, okay. Yeah, this should be fine. Yeah, yeah. No, because it's definitely not going into the yellow for you. So you can get a huh. little more. I don't know why your mic is doing this. It is odd. Also, every now and again, I hear like static in my right ear. That is unrelated. That's just a thing that happens uh, with the current setup. Haunted stream. Stream can't hear it, so it's fine. We're running a slightly scuff, oh. scuff show tonight. The haunted cameras as well. Oh, that's fine. Blew up a little bit. Oh, finds a counter for 41. Wait, what? Oh, no. 41. Oh, he's going deep too. Oh, Recognize dear. Dead. He went in. Damn. <laughs> well. Are we seeing a swap from Kunai? Surely, right? I can see that. He has enough characters he can play, but he'd be able to swap. Is this where we see the Terry? Would you say Terry would fare better than Sephiroth? I have no clue. I'm not the person to ask about that, because I don't know much about Terry or Sephiroth. Sure. I, sure. Okay. I didn't expect that. I had it in the back of my mind. Nah, you're subconscious. I mean, it's like it's a feasible assumption. Terry gone. Reduce that. Oh dear. Big swings. Four sides. Gets a small punish. Just kind of. Oh, it's gonna be a down throw. No follow up. Nah. Swapping the pirate at thirty. Sabi's off the ledge. Snapping. Blue just kind of doing what Sephiroth does best, just sitting back. Just chilling. Cops and Uppy. I've seen a lot of swaps from um, Kunai like really quickly. Which I guess... Mix it up. It is one way to play this character, yeah. Is constantly keep someone on their toes and like make them second guess like what do they have to look yeah. out for. Like why wait until someone gets used to what you're doing on the yeah. other when, when they're just constantly moving. And it's also the game of like... It's very hard to get in as Pyro, but if you get in as Mithra and then hit him with a cheeky swap, yeah, you can. You have access to a lot of stuff. A lot of damage. Shields that forward throw. Jump off oh. flame nova. Kuna's been playing clean so far. I'm very interested to see who takes this first. Oh, been ambitious. Might be the death of him. He's still alive. Finds a side B. Blue doing an incredible job of just shielding all these pyro aerials. The moment one of them hits, he's dead. Oh, might be dead? Ooh. Yeah, he's dead. Yeah, kills. You know, Sephiroth is a light fella. No kill throws from Sephiroth. So Kunai has the lead, but by how much, I guess is the question here. Mm. Can he hold on to this, or is he going to get, like, hit by something wacky? Big explosion doesn't hit him. Side from the ledge. Some big damage. Oh, this is going good. Okay, gets yeah. hit for that. Sense. A 50% lead is actually pretty decent. Yeah, I feel like Sephiroth can easily make that back. That is true. 
and oh, we'll see. Yeah, Blue he's, is doing he's it. Practically even, but he is in one interaction, basically brought it back. Oh, still alive. Bit of a scare though. And the good thing is like several also on the characters that can contest for range of some of these guys. Yeah, like absolutely. Which is. Sephiroth deals with a lot of sorties fairly well by just being a bigger range yeah. better sortie. Out sorting. It's it's fun. It's just, he's definitely one of the characters that like if I'm going to come <gasps> back. Oh I thought Kunai might have been dead there. Oh he's dead. Uh, oh he went the other Okay. I guess it stopped him from falling out, but snaps the ledge. Big uppy. Eighty seven percent of Kunai. So again Blue has to play on the back foot, see if yeah. he can find the stock. Gets a snap. Kuna doesn't seem to care. Yeah, just runs around, does yeah. his aerials, shields it when he needs to. Just he knows that timing. Oh, don't fall into that. Oh, Don't air dodge off stage and die to that either. Uh. Tragic. Still, holding 50% lead and counting. 74. Definitely in a good possession. Oh, getting nice down air. Okay. Oh, dear. He's been hitting a lot of these side bays. Oh no. Is he dead? Oh, he's dead. He lost his jump. Oh. Just 